Hello, who is here? Who is here? Hi. Oh. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, sir. How may I be able to talk to you? Okay. My name is Dave. I'm a construction engineer. Okay. I'll need about 10,000 blocks for a project I'm handling down the road there for a client. Oh, um, where is the house? Because there is no ongoing project around here I do not know about. <laughs> really? Yes. <laughs> it's an 18 flat, four bedroom service apartment. Okay. I'm building for a client down the road at number at number 13. Courage Street. Yes. <laughs> wow. I know there, I know wow. there. So you're the site engineer? Wow, yeah. wow. <laughs> so can you help me get them? My supplier just cancelled and my client is coming to supervise tomorrow. Oh, uh, we do not have up to 10k blocks at hand. I can see. Mm. But I will get the blocks for you. Wow. Yes. Thank you. Thank you. Thank <laughs> so, um, just give me an hour okay. and your contact. Contact. 080-844-232-18. All right. Thank you, sir. Dave, don't. All right, all right. I'll get back to you. All right, please, I'll be expecting you. No problem. Thank you so much. No problem. Right. Thank you. <sighs> Why are you not just serious with your life? Why are you like this? <laughs> You're just a stupid fellow. <laughs> um. Guess what? Ah, bestie. Guess. Um, <laughs> I met this cute guy at my shop today. He is very intelligent. And of course, he is well to do. <laughs> yeah. Um, he's an engineer by profession. And he owns his own um, construction company on the island. What do you mean that if I love him? <laughs> of course, I love his money. His money and his nice car. And I would do anything to marry him. <laughs> you know me now, you know me. <laughs> you know what? Yeah. <laughs> See, so yeah, it started with plan where you know, because First thing first, I go first hook on with Bele and we proceed from there. <laughs> you know me now. <laughs> if I don't marry a meme, I bye. Yes. Okay, start the plan with him. Judge the plan the wedding just now. Just the drum. <laughs> Stupid fellow. I'll see you tomorrow, okay? Alright, bye. <laughs> Who's there? Oh, I'm here. Hi. Welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. Please. Sit down. All right. Oh. You're welcome to my humble level. Thank you very much. Ah, uh, first of all, first of all, let me say a very big thank you to you for saving my ass. My clients would have been very mad at me if I had not completed that, that project. Like, you're welcome, sir. I'm glad I was able to help, sir. I beg leave that, sir. Call me Dave. Okay, Mr. Dave. Dave. <laughs> so. Tell me about yourself. What is a beautiful girl like you doing in the block industry, selling blocks? I don't want to bore you with my stories. It's a very boring one. <laughs> Unfortunately, I love boring stories. Tell me, I want to hear. Okay. Um. I was born into a wealthy family of five. Father, mother, and three children. I 
about 20 years ago, I was seven. <sighs> I'm Robert's attacked our house. They killed my parents and siblings. Mm. They took away everything valuable. <sighs> I save that was not enough. The family took away all my father's properties and asked me to stay with my uncle. <laughs> my uncle. My uncle raped me many times. What? Until I was... 17 and decided to run away. Oh. So sorry to hear that. So sorry. So, um... I did some part-time courses on education because I love to teach. <laughs> but who uh, employ someone like me who does not have anyone at the top? So, um, that was why I got a job at a block workshop. Before now, I... I did some menial jobs to survive. I'm so sorry about your story. It's a very touching one. But I'll do everything in my power to get you a better job. Okay? Okay? Thank you. Wow. So. Oh, you're done? Yes, ma. Um, he's doing the assignment I gave him. Oh, good. Um, please sit. Oh, thank you very much, mama. You know, my husband just arrived, and I think it will be a good sign mm -hmm. to meet with him. All right. By the way, you're really adding up lately. <laughs> what have you been eating? <laughs> Look at thank you. Thank you, ma. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You're welcome. Bye. You're welcome. Bye. Bye. It's always a pleasure to see you. <laughs> thank you, ma. Yes, darling. Yes, this is my voice. You're charging them here. Oh. Look at this man. Oh. <laughs> Meet Miss Amarachi, Strive's teacher. Oh, Miss Amarachi. Nice meeting you. Thank you. Yeah. She has been so diligent, so good in teaching her child. Oh, really? Miss mm -hmm. Amara, mm, thank you so very much. Thank you. I heard you've been the brain behind our son's academic excellent lately. <laughs> I heard you've been topping this class. Yes, yes, sir. Um, Strive is improving every day. Wow. <laughs> um, by the way, how is Canada? Oh, Canada. Well, very beautiful and uh, cold as usual. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, honey? Yes, the gift that I bought for her.
<laughs> so, is um, actually my dream to relocate to Canada. Oh, that's good. And um, I will do anything to pay you back if you could help me. With your fiancé? Oh, thank you so much, sir. There you go. Oh, thank you. You're thank welcome. you so much. <laughs> thank you. You're welcome. Oh, thank you. You're welcome. So, um, let's not forget, I'll be traveling to Paris tomorrow for business. Oh, really? Um, is Trive going with you? No, 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 not at all. I want him to, you know, focus on his coaching. He's going to be home with his dad all through. But please, I know we'll make it drop from that level at all. <laughs> no, not at all. Safe trip, ma. Thank you so much. You do me a favor. Please and please do take care of my son. Oh, I will. I will. You can trust me on that. <laughs> thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Oh, thank you once again for the day. Thank, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. My best is trying. Oh, my Chuchu is back! Oh, come to the Fine! Oh! So, Ooh. how was sight today? Because you look so tired. Fine. Chief was around to inspect the project today. Oh, really? Yeah. Did he like it? He loved it. Thank <laughs> God. Yeah, thank, thank God. God. Uh, so, how did you go? Did you go to the talks? Yeah, I did. It was fine, fine, fine. Wow. <laughs> um, the boy likes me already. Oh. And the mother too. Mm. So, the husband came back from Canada today. Oh. Wow. Mm -hmm. Okay. Thank you so much. Of course. For everything. The money, the teaching job, and of course, my baby. Yes, baby. Um, <laughs> uh, um, babe, see, you've not seen anything. This teaching job is just to keep you busy. Once I finish this project, I'm happy to achieve. But then you can live anywhere in the world that you want. Really? <laughs> this, oh. this, this is the biggest project I've handled in my entire career. Mm. Seriously. It's cheap. <laughs> Hello, good evening, sir. What? You didn't collapse? <laughs> no, it's not possible. Uh, no, no, I didn't cut corners, no. I have never cut corners in my... Hello? Chief, hello? Chief, what's going on with you? What happened? He said he got a call and you didn't collapse. How? Hey, don't you know? I have never cut corners. No. How is that this? I surprised it myself. Oh. How do I pay the balance? Hey, I am doomed. Baby, um, don't worry, okay? Don't worry. <laughs> when will I get money? I know, I know. <laughs> we are in this together, okay? Trust me, everything will be fine. We will oh, oh. face everything, okay? Oh. <laughs> we'll face it together. You. I know we'll face it together, please. Just know that we're in this together, okay? We'll face it together, okay? How do I pay the money? Come on, come on. Relax. Relax, baby, relax. Relax, baby, relax. Relax, baby, relax.
Mama, that's why I see him. This man wanted to give me heart attack. <laughs> so, I got to the site. From afar, I saw the house standing. I was like, ah. Don't be the house where I say fall with this. And I removed my phone. And I called Chief. He started laughing. What kind of a joke is this? <laughs> Seriously. I now walked inside. As I entered the house, lo and behold, it was a surprise birthday party. I won't faint, Mama. <laughs> yes, so. Hey, Mama, wait, Mama, wait. Before you go. I'm bringing home somebody very special very soon. And I know you will like her. Yes, now. <laughs> okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> I take you now. Uh, let me call on you, actually. Why is that number not going? Switched off. I've been calling this girl since morning. And the number has not been going. What's happening? What's this? Dave, I guess this is not supposed to be. I'm gone for greener's pasture. Don't worry about the pregnancy. It's not yours anymore. Thanks for everything. And happy birthday. No, now. No. This babe left me because of a prank Chief played on me. Amara, how are you? I'm fine. Please come in. Thanks. Yeah, I thought I'd come prepare something special for you and Strive. Oh. I'm sure you must be missing his mother's food by now. Well, that's very thoughtful of you, but you know we have a cook. I know, um, but he can prepare the special dish I brought for you. Supposed to pick her out the airport in about um, two hours' time. What? 
assassiné Je Ouais. How? What are you doing? Hmm. What are you doing? What does it look like I'm doing? Celebrating, of course. <laughs> Don't tell me you knew about this. <laughs> this is my wife for crying out loud. You just trusted it. Prostitute, gold digger, gangster, call me whatever you want. You this ungrateful goat. Ungrateful for what? Honey. You told me you were going to divorce her and marry me. But I gave you more than you wanted. And now you're calling me names. Besides, I'm I'm pregnant for you. And I'm carrying your baby. This is the mother of my son. And I'm the mother of your daughter. The daughter you've always wanted. Um, are you expecting someone? I wasn't expecting anyone. Alright, let me get you done. just like that after everything I have done for you Amara I mean apart from your salary I give you extra cash I give you clothes name it and all you could think of was to get me assassinated gang your boyfriend whom you sent to assassinate me is currently in the police custody and don't you even think of trying to know how I found out about all this. Let's just say I have a smart son. And you, you didn't tell her. Oh, you forgot. You forgot to mention it to her that I own everything. And you have nothing. You are nothing. Please, hold it. You hear from my lawyers. Officers. Please come take these disgusting criminals off my face. Take them off! <laughs> 